In this video, we'll be looking at the REI Multi Towel Lite, which is one of the 10 best camping towels that I review on this channel. I'll be unboxing and testing the REI Lite against dirt, sand, and seawater. I will also give you a breakdown of its key features such as material, absorbency, quick drying abilities, and more. Let's get right into it. Here's the multi towel light from REI, extra large, which I paid 17 US dollars for, and it was a closeout item on sale. And with that, let's get into the unboxing. So what's in the box? A storage pouch and the towel. Here are the official specs of the REI Multi Towel Lite. These are somewhat accurate but I'll just give you my personal measurements anyway. Length 53 inches or 135 cm, width 24 inches or 61 cm, weight of towel 189 grams or 6.7 ounces, weight of storage pouch 12 grams or 0.4 ounces. Packed size, 7 by 7 by 1.5 inches or 18 by 18 by 4 cm. The REI Lite is made of 100% polyester and is made in Korea. The REI Multi Towel Lite has a hanging loop so you can hang your towel on a hook at home, on a clothesline in the outdoors or even on your pack when you're hiking. You can also just hang it to dry without the loop. For additional convenience, it is machine washable in cold water and can be tumbled dry on low. The storage pouch has ventilation on one side, while the other side is made of a lightweight material. It also comes with a hanging loop. The REI light is also marketed to be very absorbent and easy to wring out. Is it though? Let's test it to find out. To test absorbency, I measured the amount of water in this bucket, soaked the REI multi towel light, and measured whatever water was left. So essentially, the REI light absorbed 450 ml of water. As it weighs 189 grams, total absorbency is 450 divided by 189, which is about 2.4 times. I also performed the same test on a similar size cotton bath towel, which absorbed 1,100 ml of water and has higher absorbency of 3.26 times. As the con towel is quite a bit fluffier, it beats the REI light in terms of absorbency. After soaking the REI multi towel light, I wringed out as much water as possible. Here's the REI light before wringing and after wringing. After wringing, the REI light weighed 405 grams or 14.3 ounces. This means that 48% of water was left. As for the cotton towel, it weighed 842 grams or 29.7 ounces after wringing and 46% of water was left. Here's the comparison between the REI light and the cotton towel. If you enjoyed what you've seen so far, please hit that like button as it will really help me to produce more content like this for you. Thank you. After wringing, I left both the REI multi towel light and the cotton towel to dry outdoors. The REI light started off at 405 grams or 14.3 ounces and dried completely in about 55 minutes. On the other hand, the cotton towel took 2 hours and 15 minutes to dry. When left indoors to dry after wringing, the REI light took a total of 7 hours and 15 minutes to dry completely. In contrast, the cotton towel took much longer, drying only after 27 hours. Here's a summary of the outdoor and indoor timings for this drying test. The REI light is much less fluffy, so it dried more quickly. For this next drying test, I measured 100 ml or 3.4 fluid ounces of water for the REI multi towel light and also for the cotton towel and left both of them to dry outdoors. This is to make sure that both towels absorb the same amount of water. 
the REI light started off at 289 grams or 10.2 ounces and dried completely in about 29 minutes. As for the cotton towel, it took slightly longer, drying in about 40 minutes. I also conducted the same test indoors. When left indoors, the REI light took 4 hours to dry completely. On the other hand, the cotton towel took much longer, drying in about 7 hours. Here's a summary of the outdoor and indoor timings for this 100ml drying test, which shows that the REI light dries much more quickly than the cotton towel. I soaked both the REI multi-towel light and cotton towel in seawater, wringed out whatever I could, then sealed both in separate plastic bags. At the two-day mark, the REI light had a damp sea smell, which didn't smell too bad. On the other hand, the cotton towel smelled sour and unpleasant. At the four-day mark, the REI light still smelled the same, while the cotton towel started smelling like food that had gone bad. I also checked for mold, and there wasn't any. I did the same 96-hour test after showering as well, and found that the REI light had almost no smell, while the cotton towel started smelling musky. For this grass and dirt test, I dragged both the REI multi-towel light and the cotton towel along some grass and stepped on them. The REI light picked up a few flakes of grass, some of which didn't come off even after shaking. The cotton towel picked up a little more dirt, which I thought came off easily, but after getting home, I noticed some dirt was still stuck to it. For this test, both towels didn't do very well. For the sand test, I covered both the REI multi-towel light and the cotton towel with sand. Some sand did stick to the REI light, though a few good shakes got rid of it. Sand also stuck to the cotton towel, but shaking it did the job as well. Both towels did well in the sand test. The cotton towel might have performed better than you expected because it's not fluffy and has short piles. The REI multi-towel light weighs 189 grams or 6.7 ounces, whereas a similar size cotton towel weighs 337 grams or 11.9 ounces. It is also significantly more compact. Here's what it looks like beside the cotton towel from the side and also from the top. For further comparison, here's what the REI light looks like beside a 16 ounce and a 32 ounce Nalgene bottle from the side and from the top. Both the REI light and storage pouch come with hanging loops for easy carry and drying. Unfortunately, if you're not tall like me, the towel will drag on the ground if you hang it on your pack. The REI multi-towel light is soft and smooth to the touch. It's not stiff at all, and the extra large is a good size for a shower towel. It sticks to your skin a little bit, so you might want to pat down instead of wiping. As for quality, the stitching is consistent with no gaps, and the material is intact with no loose threads or fraying. After about 3 months of usage, the weight of the REI light was still the same, so no material was lost. The colour also does not bleed when washed, even on the first wash. The hanging loop is useful and secure, but the catch can be a bit stiff. As for the storage pouch, it's strong yet lightweight at the same time, though I would prefer zippers to the current Velcro opening. I read the reviews on the REI website and here's what I found. Positive reviews have said that the REI light is quick drying, packs small, is lightweight, is absorbent, and the hanging loop is useful. For my testing, I found that while the REI light dries about 30% faster than a cotton towel, it definitely isn't the fastest drying camping towel out there. It also packs significantly smaller than a cotton towel, but again, isn't the smallest towel. Also, my REI light had a low absorbency of 2.4 times. The hanging loop is useful for sure, but if you buy the extra large and you're not tall like me, the towel will drag on the ground if you hang it on your pack. On the other hand, negative reviews have said that it smells after a few uses, it sticks to your body, and isn't very absorbent. I agree with most of these, though my REI light didn't smell as bad as I thought it would. So what are my personal pros and cons for the REI multi-towel light? Pros. The material is soft and smooth to the touch and is pretty comfortable. As for cons, it's not the most absorbent camping towel in the market and doesn't ring out well either. As for other aspects like drying time, odor resistance, dirt repellents, and portability, the REI light isn't bad, but isn't good at the same time. 
it's just very average when compared to other camping towels on the market. So neither a pro nor a con for these. Would I recommend the REI Multi Towel Lite? Well, it's a decent quality camping towel and it beats a regular cotton towel in almost all aspects. Like it dries 30% faster, it has better odor resistance, and it packs much smaller amongst other things. But the thing is, when compared to other camping towels, the REI Lite is pretty much just average. There's nothing outstanding about it, and that's what I think. If you'd like to find out which camping towel is the best for you, here's a video where I bought 10 of the best camping towels on the market and tested them rigorously. If you enjoyed this review, I'm sure you would enjoy that video too. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.